Hey everybody, welcome to My Usual Me and welcome back to Above Snakes where we play the prologue and it's coming out today in about an hour. So if you're watching me right now, then it's not out yet, but it will be. And so we're going to go ahead and play a little bit and see how much they've advanced it, or as much as we can in a couple hours. Let me go ahead and say hello to everybody who said something before the live stream started. Canadian Guy 18, how you doing? Becky Bender, hello. Brooklyn Bella, hi, hi. Uh, Article 5, good to see you. Kuja, how you doing, buddy? Let's see here, who else is in here? Normad Norm. Magic Llama. I don't know who else is in here. Uh, uh, Nan no, okay, I think I, I think I got everybody. If I missed your name, though, let me know and I'll say hello. All right, let's go ahead and let's drop this music down and we'll get going. Okay, so they're finally going to release the game. I mean, they always said it was going to be the 25th. All right, so let's go ahead and this is a top down. I don't normally do top downs, but this is a pretty good game. So we, uh, I mean, for, you know, for what it was. Uh oh, it sounds like it's really low in the audio. Can you guys hear that? Hang on, let me turn my audio up a little bit. Turn my audio up so I can hear it better. If you guys can't hear it, let me know. Now we uh we we're on day eight, but I think I'm gonna start a new journey. Yeah, you guys want to start a new journey, or you want to continue on where we were? Let's start a new journey. I think. We'll start over. The conflict between the settlers and the first people was at its peak. The drums of war echoed across the land like a never-ending thunder. While war raged on, a love blossomed from the fields of hate. And from that love, a child was born. Ayana, who had eventually grown into her own, chose to travel the lands and learn for herself the histories of her lineage. With a heavy heart, her mother stayed behind in a town called Corpse Creek. On one fateful evening in Corpse Creek, the midnight skies were interrupted by a light of brilliant green. The awe of such an event quickly dissolved into horror as a flurry of stones of flame descended upon the town. Most folks fell victim to the debris and smoke that consumed the land, but the survivors quickly discovered that the bodies did not remain still for long. That night, Ayana had stayed in the lumberjack settlement, far away from her beloved mother. Okay. Zombie meteors, guys. I have to wake up. <sighs> All right. Keyboard and mouse. I don't know what you're trying to do here, game. What are you trying to do here, game? Options. Freaking resolutions. That's 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 some horse shit. Hang on, we gotta fix that. There we go. Gameplay. Controls. I mean, are you? There it is. Okay. It had to rec. I had to move for it to recognize it. I was trying to click on it. Anna, you awake? Yeah, I'm awake. Hang on. Let me grab my backpack. All right. Your backpack. Uh, use the enter to open your backpack. You can access your backpack at any time. You can manage your inventory, craft items, new or current quests. Note that some items require a special crafting station nearby that could be craftable. So, well, it's tab. Not, back, not, not, not enter. <laughs> okay. Um... I've got my robe. All right. There's a crafting stations. Shelter and perks. 
We have several different slots here for our gear. And our quest log is empty. Let's go ahead and go on out. Oh, wait. All right, so we've got a, a book and a coin, which we can use for trades. I think that's everything. All right, Q to rotate the camera to the left, E to the right. Does it in chunks. Hmm. All right. Oh, my, my. <laughs> what are we to do? The horror that came over us. Are you okay? I know, but first things first, are you okay? I'm not hurt, by, so I guess I'm okay. It's just uh, my house, my beautiful house, it's in shambles. And the whole town, look at oh, look at me, bawling my eyes out about my house while the other people lost their lives. The whole thing is a mess. Yeah, it is. How can I help? Or can I help? Actually, yes, the whole town is in ruins. We can use all the help we can get. We need logs to rebuild, even though we have the sawmill over there. I doubt whether we have enough logs to rebuild these houses. All right, do you have an axe? I've been searching for my axe, but I can't find it. Uh, I do have this flint, though. If you uh, tie it to a strong branch, maybe you can craft yourself a primitive axe. I also have these hard antlers for you, which might be useful. There's uh, plenty of you. Uh, there should be plenty of materials around here to craft some primitive tools. Okay. Gather branches from the pine trees. Open your backpack and craft a primitive axe. Okay. Let's do that. Go ahead and zoom in here. Search the pine tree. You gotta hold down the F button. We got a feather. We got a branch. Now I can get the axe. We got another branch. So let's go ahead and go. Let's go ahead and craft this axe right here. There we go. With this primitive axe, I can take down trees to get lumber. Let's go ahead and go into our. Let's see, I have to equip it, right? Equipment. I have to equip. There we go. Let's go ahead and gather, search this pine tree here. Got another branch. Got a feather. Got another branch. Is it? All right, there we go. Got some lumber. Rocks are you another know, useful resource. I can make a primitive pickaxe and smash some rocks around here. All right, so let's go ahead and see what I'm going to need for that. I'm gonna. Oh, I have everything I need, so we'll craft the item because that's what the antlers were for. Now we can go ahead and we can equip the the, uh, the pickaxe in our inventory. That's it. That's the two slot, so it automatically puts it in the one of the two slots. So let's um. There we go. Holding down the left mouse button to make this happen. All right. Got our stones. Let's see what Joanne has to say. Hmm. All right, time to get started, wouldn't you say? The sawmill, it was only set up to saw lumber, plus it's unusable in its current state anyway, so we'll have to uh, build a log cabin instead of a plank one. But first, how can I forget? First, uh, can we, uh, before we can build a new house, I'll need to take down the old one. My mind is really mush these days. If you craft a hammer, you can use it to tear down my old ruined house to free up some space. Later, you can adjust the house if you need to. All right, so let's make a hammer. Okay. I thought it was going to show me how to make a hammer. Maybe not. Should be right here. Hang on. Oh, wait. Hmm. 
Okay, we already said this. There it is. Get plant fibers, craft a hammer, take down John's old house. Plant fibers are right here, I think. Let me, let me use my axe for that. There we go. There's the plant fiber. Now we have the hammer. Let's go ahead and craft that. Oh, I need I need three plant fibers. We need another one. Let's see here. There's there's another there's another one. All right. We just run over these to pick them up. Let's search this pine tree too. Another branch. Another branch. Feather. Okay. Let's search this pine tree. Looks like the items are respawning pretty quick. All right. Let's go ahead and craft a hammer. There we go. That unlocked the workbench. I need three lumber for that. All right. Adjusting structures with hammer. Use uh, use the hammer to alter pre-existing buildings or the ones you built yourself. You'll get back some of the resources. So let's go ahead. The hammer's in the three slot. And we'll take this down. There we go. Now I can make a workbench. Start building. I'm going to need to make a workbench. Some plants around here should have me, give me the plant fibers I need. All right. So I need. There's another. There's another bush right there. So we'll go ahead and we'll just grab this. Let's see if I can make a workbench. I can. We'll go ahead and craft that. And then, let's see, where do I want to set my workbench up? I think we did it over here last time. Oh, I need three more lumber. No, wait, hang on. It should be in my inventory. Is it not? I guess it's not. Okay, so I need three more lumber. I'm going to search the pine tree, and then we're going to cut it down. That's two. Just get everything off this tree before I cut it down. All right. That'll be enough. This dead body is going to cause me problems in a minute, though. It's not awake yet, but it, it's going to get. It's going to. It's going to wake up. So let's go ahead and craft this workbench. And in the four slot, we can go ahead and. And I should be able to rotate this. R. I'll put that workbench right there. All right. To interact with the workbench, uh, uh, you can craft buildings. Uh, let's see. Building parts to create your shelter. Crafting stations to refine your resources and uh, bo both useful and decorative furniture. Upgrading the workbench enables additional crafting recipes but requires certain materials. Okay. I cleaned up the mess. I'm gonna, there you go. Uh, the meteorites created time to build a new home for Joe and uh, let's see there is more lumber at the old sawmill craft at least four foundations and build a new home with walls and roofs okay we can do that let's go ahead and get some more a 
Probably going to need all the stuff, so we're going to grab everything off the trees before we cut them down. And they'll grow back, so I'm not worried about it. Am I going to plan on doing a live stream from Mars? No, I'm going to keep that a I'm going to keep that a, just a, a regular series. It's doing fine the way it is right now, so I'm not going to I'm not going to mess with with what's working. But there will be there will be a, uh, a, a Occupy Mars video out today. Later on. No. Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh wait, I may not have to. I might not have to um, search. I might be able to just cut these down and get the other rest of the stuff on them. Nope. Well, I got a branch. I think I'm gonna. I think I need to search these. Hang on. Yeah, we're good. All right, drop that, and we're going to cut these down too. Do I have a, a, a dirt? I don't think I have a a carry weight on this. Yeah, I don't think there's a carry weight, so I think we're going to be okay here. Got some stones too. Make the tree fall over on the stone. By the way, hello Roy Bailey. Hello Thermal Paste. Hope y'all. Hope everybody's doing good today. And I'm gonna grab this fiber too. this another branch over here I get everything I think I did wait there's something over here she's not rooter running all right four foundations so there's two three there's four. I'm also going to need a door. So we'll make that. Um, I'm going to need, you know what? We'll do a couple of windows. And um, let's see. One, two, three, four. Six. Six walls. Five walls. That's five. And then I'm going to need four roofs. So I'm going to need three more lumber. Let's find another tree. Or two more trees. What's up, Wally? Good morning, morning. Oh, you're not going to let me get that log? Bastard. What's in here? Oh, we had some lumber here. There we go. That'll do. Let's make three more roofs. Wait, did I, do I have roofs still? Did I make a roof? Why did I make another, uh, well, how did I make four workbenches?
Oh, that's what's in the slot. Why did I make a workbench, though? That's weird. Alright, anyway, I need four. Four roofs. All right, that should do. All right, in the five slot, we'll go ahead and throw down. So I can adjust the height, so we want to raise that up a little bit. Okay, the better the shelter is constructed, the more shelter it will provide. The more shelter it provides, the more perks it will unlock that give bonuses. That's right, I forgot about that. All right, let's go ahead and throw a door down. All right, chair. Let's go ahead and do uh, a couple of windows. And I'll put another window right there. And then we will Throw down the rest of the walls. And let's go ahead and throw down all of the roofs. Let's rotate that. There we go. There's the house. All right. Wow, look at that home. Great work. There's something else that requires our immediate attention, though. I just realized that the person lying over there is still breathing. He inhaled the smoke of the meteorite last night and fainted. L later, some debris seemed to have wounded him. When I found him this morning, I checked on him, and he certainly was not breathing anymore. But maybe there's still hope for him. You know what to do? Yeah, kill him. Uh, I never provided medical care. I don't know. Bandages should help. Maybe there's some left in the, in the old sawmill. Yeah, huh? All right, there's a wounded person lying in the hunter's uh, rest. He seems to be alive. I should search him for bandage, or search for some bandages, try to help him. Okay. Well, shift to sprint. But it'll help raise my stamina later on, so I think I can get in here. What's in the barrel? Go up here. Uh, a book and a skull. I don't know why people somebody pay for a skull. Maybe it's their. Uh... Actually, you know what? Let me go ahead and break out. I have my axe. All right, there's an old man. Hmm. Hey, how did you sleep? <laughs> I didn't sleep well at all, man. How about you? I couldn't stop turning either. Green flashes before my eyes. And then horrible rumbling in the sky. Have you seen this place? It's ruined. Used to be so cozy in here with everyone. So this is like the lodge. Alright, I've got an oil lantern. Another book. There's the bandage we're looking for. Uh, there's a deck of cards. Another book and a coin. All this stuff's going to be tradable later on, so we're going to keep it. Pick up that candle holder that I just found. Take that book. Some more books. We're going to take them for trade. Is that food? That might be food. Am I going to steal from the old man? There we go. Raw meat. He likes his steaks rare, I guess. All right, stop the bleeding. Heal the wounded person. Except, they're not bleed. They're not wounded. They're dead. Oh no! He turned into one of those things. Be careful. They're extremely aggressive. All right. So, space to perform a dodge roll. Which is some horse shit. I need a bow. Uh, 
So you're you have a pretty long reach. Let's loot this guy. Steal his stuff. Got bones. I got a bone axe I can make. That poor guy, I think that the people that inhaled the smoke from the meteorites are turning into those monstrosities. It's so horrible. You look pale, are you okay? Yeah, I could be better. Uh, I can imagine that maybe you should get something to eat. We should have some food around here. Uh, the surrounding surroundings of Hunter's Rest always have berry bushes aplenty as well. Um, you can use this map and search for some berries to snack on. So hand me a map. And that's going to be... All right. Hard work and uh, fighting make, has made me hungry. I should go and find some berry bushes and eat a bite. All right, let's do that. And a new world piece. Now, this is the thing about this game. Is you get to create your own map. So within reason. Like certain map pieces snap together with other certain map pieces. And you can do transitions from one type of terrain to another. And so I'm going to need water. I'm going to need food. And, um, and then, of course, the, the storyline will require certain map pieces that we're going to have to build so we can, ex we can continue along the storyline. So that is, um, that's one of the things that I, I like. I don't like normally do top downs, but I like this game because of that. I can build my own map. Normally, the, the developers build the map. They're like, no, nah, we'll give you the pieces. You can do your own thing. So, and, uh, so I like this. So, even though, I mean, I don't know. Anyway, I was, never mind, we're good. Okay, so let's go and find some berry bushes. I know I got some. I don't really even need the map, but I guess we can look in the map. So here's the map. Oh, it wants me to make a new world piece. All right, so, that's right. So, C to make a new world piece. I can make a moderate, moderate climate world piece, and I can put it wherever I want. I think I'm going to put it right here. It doesn't really, the first piece doesn't matter really where you put it, but um, now there's going to be berry bushes on this map piece, so we're going to collect the huckleberries. I'll be your huckleberry. Uh, to create more world pieces, you'll need to scout your surroundings first. You, uh, you, your scouting progress is shown at the bottom of the screen, and note that you can stack up to scouting three world pieces, but scouting takes longer the more pieces you hold. Oh no, I don't want to do that. Collect the huckleberries, dude. There we go. Okay. Hey, Mad Moo. All right, so this is a moderate uh, p uh, map piece, so I don't think I'm going to have any problems. It says, don't starve, eat some berries. So let's go ahead and go over to our... Well, our backpack, go to consumables, and then we're going to go ahead and eat. There we go. It's the next day. It says return to Joanne, but I'm going to collect more huckleberries. Because we're going to need these resources later on. And you can use them for different things, too, so. So on the bottom right hand side of the screen, by the way, you see there's a there's a teardrop. That's my that's my hydration. We see uh, our stomach. That's our food. Um, I, I think is that. Let's see, we have sanity. Redu uh, let's see reduces in response to several occurrences as to when uh, you're searching a grave or making uh, contact with the lost souls. That's what they're calling the zombies. Um, it can be restored by med medicine or sleep. And then of course disease or uh, you know how tired we are. That's our fatigue. So. Still a little hungry. We should probably eat a couple more berries. That's in my seven slot right now. I could cook up. I could cook up the. Um, I should save the rest of those berries. I can cook up the um, the meat I just found. I don't know if the meat rots or not. I don't remember. Okay, now we got another world piece ready. But I want I want to go ahead and gather these. I don't want to search this pantry. 
Go ahead and get all these huckleberries. Okay. I think that's it. That's when you go back to Joanne. Well, there's another hot berry bush over there, but that's okay. Oh, that's right. I forgot. She left a letter. I'm deeply sorry. I had to leave all of a sudden. The frontier had sent a carriage to pick up survivors. At least I could do was leave the cabin to you. But you built it after all. You couldn't wait. You couldn't tell the carriage to wait for me so I could get out of here too? They said the plague has been spreading from Corpse Creek. They, they reported meteorites falling there to, down there too. Horrible. Some of the people survived, but most of them fled. If you talk to them, maybe they'll uh, bring some light into the dark. Sincerely, Joanne. Okay, well, that's, that's that. There must be people who survived the plague in Corpse Creek. We just saw one inside the, the lodge. I've heard that there's a camp nearby. To get more information about what happened, I need to see if there are any survivors. So find the survivor's camp. All right, so. Make it your own. Hunter's Rest is left behind by all the survivors. The remaining houses after or offer valuable resources for survival. Use the hammer and take down the remaining two buildings to make this place your own. Okay, so we can take down the old sawmill and take down the small house with the hammer. So, wants me to take down this house, yo. I think I got everything out of it, so. All right. It wants me to take down the sawmill, too. Sorry, old man. Okay, so now we're by ourselves. Hey, Juby Booby. Congratulations on making your first shelter at Hunter's Rest. You can keep it and use it for your survival or take it down and build it up anywhere else. That's completely up to you. Okay. Well, we're going to keep it for now. This land is full of mysteries to explore, but before I can go exploring, I need to make my cartography table uh, to work on my map. All right, so we're going to build a cartography table from the workbench and use it to research a new world piece and then place a plains to Pine Forest World Peace. So I'm going to, can I move this? I don't know if I can move this or not. I don't think I can. Actually, you know what? We'll just leave it. That's fine. So we have a cartography bench in here somewhere. There it is. I need one ink. To make ink, I need feathers and huckleberries, which I have. So we're going to make an ink. Now we can make our cartography table. And uh, also, I'm going to need a campfire. So, uh, I need flint. And I'm going to need a bed. So let's make a bed right quick because we're going to have to sleep. So, and then before we do anything else, let me go ahead and place this bed in my cabin. Uh oh. I was it? Uh oh. I may have to tear this down. Because I, I, I raised those those foundations up, and I, they're, they're too high. There's a divot there. I don't know if I can make stairs or not. Let's see if I can make stairs. Where's my workbench? Oh, there it is. Hiding in plain sight. Um, log step. Here we go. We'll craft that. There we go. Going to our inventory. Actually, if I'm in within range, I can go ahead and I can craft. Where is it? Furnace. That's crafting. That's not my backpack. Here we go. Building. There we go. And we'll place this right there. Now I should be able to get it in and out. There we go. All right, I need to put my bed down. There we 
we go. We can save the game. There we go. Save the game. And I think I put the cartography workbench down. Oh, you know what? Let's just put it down next to this one. Since there's nothing there. Put that right there. All right. Now I can research another map piece. So we're going to research that world piece. It's Plains to Fire Forest, or uh, Plains to Pine Forest. And then I can go ahead, and during your journey, you'll come across different uh, biomes. You can place these biomes wherever you want on the map, but you need to make sure that the, the, to create transi transitions between them. The biome on the edge of each world piece needs to match the surrounding world pieces. Think about that when you place the new world piece. And water is a big deal with that one, so... By the way, let me pick a perk from my workbench here. So, shelters and perks. So now I can pick one perk. I can fortify my shelter. Maximum health increases by 10. Uh, whetstone sharpens your weapons. Your melee damage is increased by 3. Or, hay, balls are, hay beds are softer. Maximum fatigue and maximum sanity are increased by 15. Um, let's go ahead and let's do the fatigue and stamina. Let's do that. That's going to be my, my perk that I have right now. Okay, so... Place the planes to, to let's see. So we're gonna go map, and this is planes. Now you can edit the world too, so you can change it up if you need to. I gotta, oh, I gotta make the new world piece. Here we go. So we're making the planes to pine forest. And I can rotate it with R. I think we're going to put it right here. Nah. Yeah, that'll work. We'll place it. No, that works. Okay. To expand my shelter, I should search nearby forest for more resources. Yeah, I'm good on that, though. And cartography tables telling me I've got another piece available to me. I need four I need three more rocks to be able to research. So let's grab our our pickaxe here. It's three rocks. I should be able to do this now. Research the pine forest. There we go. Go ahead and chop down. Chop down some some stuff here. Oh, I need to make a. I need to make a um, campfire. If I'm close enough to my to my bench, I can just do stuff out of my inventory. I don't need to worry about it. I need a flint. I need uh, two lumber and two rocks. So let's chop this down. Is anybody uh, interested in seeing the new Gollum game that's coming out? You know, Gollum, Lord of the Rings. It's coming out on all the platforms today. Here in a, just a couple hours. I thought about getting it, but I don't know. All right, so C to make a new world piece. So now we've got the pine forest, and since I've got the plains to pine forest, we're going to do this. I'm going to slap that right there. Because that, that transitions, so. Now I have the pickaxe and the axe, which should make it easier to chop things down. Check out the cartography table, but what's the workbench say? 
If I upgrade my workbench, I'll be able to build more complex things. Every workbench level requires certain resources for upgrading. So if I upgrade my workbench... I need... Okay, I need three beeswax and five plant fibers, so I don't... I can't do that right now. Cartography bench. I have a, a, a survivor's camp. I need four rocks to be able to put, to put the survivor's camp down. So let's go ahead and let's uh, let's get some rocks. Oh, there's a stick. I'm going to need some rocks. There's a rock right here. Article 5 says sure when it comes to that to the new game. It's become dusk. That means that night is close. If you're not willing to fight all kinds of dangers in the wild, you should return to your shelter or build one. It's also wise to have a light source and enough logs to fuel it before night falls. Well, wait, let me get... Okay. Got to get a campfire working. Set up and light the campfire and cook a berry bowl. Berry bowls are great, but I'm going to... I got to make this, though. All right. Didn't I say I needed stones? I need one flint. But where's my flint? I gotta make a flint. Don't I? Can I make a flint from making stones? Hang on. Crafting. I can make a flint with two rocks. That's what we're doing. There it is. Now I can make my fire. Oh, I'm short of rock. <laughs> no. Nope, I'm not muted. Not this time. All right, once again. Let's go ahead and make this campfire. All right. Let's go to the nine slot. Or the eight slot. Eight slot. Here we go. I'm going to just put the campfire right here. And then all right now let's go ahead and cook up ourselves a, a berry bowl delicious and nutritious meal but if I add more to it I get more oh I'm gonna get a new recipe actually let's back that out I'm gonna make what it asked me to do oh tea to cook Okay, I got a cooked meal. Or was it just a berry bowl it wanted me to do? Hang on, let me just do that. All right, so let's go something new. So we'll cook that up. I discovered... Oh, that was the berry bowl. New recipe in the book. Hang on. Consumables. Huckleberry Bowl, 25 hunger, 10 thirst. This other bowl, this this cooked meal is just uh, four, th four thirst, 10 hunger. I'm going to eat that, eat that. And then we're going to eat this one too. All right, that's, I'm still going to be thirsty, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and let's add another lumber. Twice. That fills my campfire all the way up. Let's see about making um, a berry. That's just a cooked meal. Actually, that's a new recipe. We'll just add that and see what happens. Meat. Cooked meat. Okay, cool. It's nighttime. I am... All right, I'm not exhausted anymore. Or am I exhausted? I can't tell. Okay, I'm not tired. It must be the berry bowls that were that were helping me out. Let's go ahead and cook some more berry bowls.
All right. That'll do. It needs me to make the survivor camp though. I need I need rocks. Got those. I got a flint out of the deal too. That's great. You hate to uh, come across a, a deer that could smash rocks with antlers. All right, so let's go with. Oh, it's a cartography bench. So it's talking. To, oh, I need one more lumber. To, do, to get the survivor's camp. So let's go, let's chop down this tree over here. Come on. Search it. There we go. So we've got a couple of, of world pieces now. we got a new one on top of the survivor's camp. So I'm going to need more stuff. Never hurts to get that fiber either, since I'm right here. Okay. So we can make this world piece. Survivor's camp. And then we got a moderate climate. This one is plains to pine forest. We, 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 it's a, that's the second plains to pine forest we've got, but it's a different orientation. If you see that it, this one is a, it got a little circle. So it's like a circle corner. This one is a uh, is a diagonal. So we're gonna go ahead and learn that since I've got it. So it's a little different. Let's see here. I am thirsty, but we're gonna need to. I gotta eat a berry bowl. Let me eat a couple of those. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna eat. Just so I can get my thirst back up. I'm going to eat all my berry bowls. That way my, my thirst are all the, all the way back up. So the survivor camp, what are we going to do here? Looks like the game just saved. We go C. Oh, I can just put it on top of No, there's no way. No, no, okay. So I need to put it somewhere... We'll put it down here. We'll put it down here. I think. Or maybe I'll put it there so it's not attached to anything just yet. There we go. Survivor's Camp has uh, a bunch of a bunch of Z's in it, so we got to be careful. Um, so let's see here. I need to go get a bunch of huckleberries. Let me zoom, zoom down here. Because we're going to need these huckleberries for too long. No, the fire doesn't uh, replenish your sanity. It does not. And I'm doing okay, though. Yeah, I forgot about the, the fire uh, replenishing your stamina. But until we can get the, until we can get the water situation squared or uh, squared away with the world piece, then we're gonna huckleberries are how we get in our, our moisture. So I gotta collect all these. We gotta keep 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 on this, or I'm gonna be in trouble. We'll be fine for a minute. I just got to continue with the storyline. That way it'll keep unlocking pieces. But we need huckleberries for sure, for sure. 
I don't know if there's a stack limit. It's probably 99. And it wouldn't hurt for me to upgrade my workbench either. Does anybody remember what it was? I forget what it was. Go ahead and... Okay, we're going to have a new map piece in a minute. Every time I collect something, it gives me a little bit more. There it is. It's getting dark. Let's head back. Start a fire back up. I think that food's starting to go bad. Add a little bit more fuel. All right, there we go. Now it's full. All right, berry bulls it is. Hopefully this will last for a little bit. Hey, Girl for Genius, how you doing? Got a few more left, guys. time okay let's go over here and let's check out the to upgrade my workbench I needed what oh beeswax that's right I don't have bees bees yet that's right all right let's go ahead and check this out go to the table I need bees I'll go ahead and crash out for the night Any update on the homestead chance? It's been up for a month, dude. Karabi. But, um... I was, I was doing... I was going to do new videos on Sunday, uh, Sundays and Wednesdays, but Mother Nature's decided it wanted to kick me in the teeth, so I can't... I, I didn't do a video or, or yesterday. So it'll be Sunday before you get another video. I need to go find I feel thirsty there must be some nearby lakes so I can get some water from it. yeah find a lake but you're gonna have to oh wait hang on that's why I made all these berry bowls There we go. I'm full of water now. Let's go to let's go get a map piece worked out. If it gives me the water, the the lake uh, map piece, yeah, it did. I've got everything I need. So we got a plains to lake map piece. Now this right here, you got to watch out because you're gonna want more water. So you don't want to you don't want to put this map this lake piece on it next to another like next to another. And I'll show you what I'm talking about. Um. Like, I don't want to put that lake piece right there. I want to put it on the end so I can build out a lake, like a whole lake. So, because otherwise it's going to be a pain in the butt. And I want it close to my house. So let's go ahead and make a new world piece. We're going to do this one, Plains Lake. And we're going to rotate this. I made that mistake last time we played. I think this would do. 
Or I guess I could do it here. Let's do it here. I think. No, you know what? Nah. We'll do it there. Alright, because you only get so much water from a piece. And um and then until it respawns. So we do have huckleberries in here, which is nice. We do have metal, which I presume to make a better a better piece. And you can't go into the water. I need the sparkle. Where's the sparkle? Scoop water, here we go. Got some dirty water. Unless they improved that where I can just get as much as I want. If that's the case, then I don't care. It looks like it might. Huh. I'm super tired, though. Yeah, we played this before. This We played the prologue. So, and, and you guys were saying that you wanted, uh, they were saying that they wanted me to do the do the whole thing, so. You guys were saying that, so. Let's go ahead and boil some water. I'm gonna do all three. Oh, that's three water in a row, that's great. Perfect. Now, that took care of my hydration. They must have... Oh, thanks, Robbie. Appreciate it, man. Um, by the way, hello, Pickle. Uh, so, they must have decided that having that limited water source was not good for... Uh, for people just starting out, is what I'm thinking. All right, so I need I need bees. We need bees, so we got to get some bees. So I'm gonna go search this. Uh, let's go search this camp. Now I've got food and water for a minute, so let's go ahead and search this camp right quick. I don't have an, a weapon though. I guess I have to use my axe. I heard bees. Wait, I heard bees. Okay, there we go. I think I take damage when I... Okay, there's my honey. But was it wax? I thought it was beeswax. I can make another world piece? Oh, look at this. That's a full lake cartography piece, so that's I'm gonna want that. But I gotta I gotta research it though. Got some playing cards. Got a horseshoe. Got a, key, a common key and the scrap parts, which is cool. Now I can make a trap. Cause I got those parts. Got some, I got a key, got some coins. Well, I got a key so I can open this up. I got rocks out of that for my trouble. That's not cool, man. There is an oil lantern. Another key. Two more keys. Okay. Hang on. There we go. Hmm. Good day, stranger. How'd you find us out here in, in in this nirvana? Me and my brother Greg have been out here for days and we can't go home. Okay. What happened? Well, we used to live in Corpse Creek before the night of the uh, the flames. And during our escape, we uh, lost most of our provisions. Okay. How'd you lose your provisions? We lost most of our things in a nearby prairie when, when the when our wagon was toppled in an attack by, well, let's say one of our own. Yeah, by whom did you get attacked? 
well, let's not talk about that now. It was not an easy moment for us, and we were lucky to be alive still. Now, this, this, this a fire and, and a handful of provisions are all that stand between us and the grave. Maybe it's too much to ask, but we're afraid to go back there. Do you think you can get our provisions back, being a woman and all? Sure. Because you have a gun, and I have an antler pickaxe. All right, yeah, I, I can help you get your stuff back. Oh, thank you so much. We'll be here waiting for your return. I promise to help Sam and uh, Greg Brown by retrieving their lost provisions from the prairie. Yep. Oh, my sourdough went bad, by the way. It got really, really humid in my in my house, and, and I'm going to have to replace my sourdough, just so you know. We'll talk about that in my video later on. I'll do another update video on Sunday. Another key. We're going to have to make another... Um, Did I get these? I did. Did I search those over there? Yeah, I think I did. I gotta make another map piece to find their stuff, so. Let's go ahead and, um. Food and water. I'm gonna go out to the this other this other map piece over here and we're gonna see if I can find some more bees. Oh, it's getting dark. Shit. I don't wanna do that. It just got dark out of nowhere, man. Go back to the house. We gotta start a fire. We should have enough branches to last a minute, man. And it, real quick, it is it is honey, right? Not beeswax. Or is it beeswax? It's beeswax. Shit. Can I make beeswax? I don't know if I can make beeswax or not. Hmm. Might just be a byproduct of, of, I don't think I can cook the honey either. Inedible. <laughs> I don't know, bone and honey soup. I don't know. I'm going to leave that. We're fine. You're waiting for something to grow so you can you can pickle some stuff? Yeah, it's going to be a while before I have anything growing. So that's a Z. So he's just hanging out. Is it, are those mushrooms? Those are mushrooms. Bullet mushrooms. Awesome. Oh, shit. Thought I had that axe out, man. What the hell? Stop. Stop. <laughs> It's game, dude. All right, he went down. He went. Is he gonna stay down? I got a bone. Just a single bone. I'll take these bullets, though. Nope. New world piece is ready. Well, that's nice. Garlic scape pesto. That sounds good. I, the only thing I've got in my garden right now that's 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 um, harvestable is my are my my um, my chives. And they came back this year. I didn't expect them to come back. I didn't expect so much of my stuff to come back. I don't know why. 
I planted that stuff so it would come back, so. Hey, Garwin. How you doing? I haven't been a Corpus Christi in forever. Some flint out of that. That's good. I gotta go see if maybe there's some more bees over here. I need wax. Without wax, I can't do anything. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to put down another map piece. Let's see here. See to make another map piece. What is this one? This is a Plains Prairie map piece. That's where their stuff is. So let's see. Let's go back to the to the workbench and see if I can make both of those. I don't think I can. I don't think I have enough resources on my person. We'll see what it's going to take. I need five plant fibers. I have enough for the Plains Prairie one. We'll do that. And then I'll unlock the... Let's get some... I need some bushes. Bushes! There's a bush. Well, that's a huckleberry bush. I don't want that. There we go. One more bush, and I can make that map piece. All right. Oh, we're going to eventually be able to go out and fish, so I'll, I'm going to make this... This lake map piece will just slap right in here. Right there. There we go. And then... What we'll do is we, we need these corner pieces all around the rest of this map. See, this corner piece I've got right here has to go here, here, and here. So then that's, it's going to be, I'm going to have to, I'm going to need a planes. Well, anyway, we'll, you'll, you'll see what we're doing as we go. So, and I, now I need to make the, actually, you know what, here, hang on. I can edit the world too, so if I need to. So what was that? The Plains Prairie? Is that what this was? So the Plains Prairie. I could rotate this, I guess. We could do like this. Let's do that. I think that'll work. New world piece are researchable. Okay, well, I need to eat first before I do anything else. Those two. There we go. I should probably get some more berries right quick. Got these huckleberries. Whoop, I have one more. We'll gather as it gets dark, and then we'll go cook, and then we'll go to bed.
Oh, there's a bee. Did I not even notice that? We're gonna head back, but I want this bee. I want this beehive. There we go, we got some beeswax. Got one beeswax. Here's the house. I need to heal myself though. All right, let's do another one. So I've got enough berries here. Actually, you know what, I've got these bullets. That's actually really good. We'll cook those up. Oh, I could have mixed them with the huckleberries. That's what I should have done. Mix and match and find different things we can do. go there we go we're going to crash out for the night i'm going to save this game oh it's night oh it's daytime now my sanity's looking good though all right let's find out i needed the prairie piece the lost provisions i need two more flint we can make flint from stone do i have any stone on me I've got one rock on me. Oh, we need two more stone. We need two more flint. So that means four more stone. Another rock over here. I got a flint. How many flint? I got three flint now. I think I'm just going to go ahead and just pound this rock. Maybe I'll get another flint. I did. All right, let's go make that map piece. That's cool. And... There it is, the Lost Provisions. That is a prairie piece, so... The only place I can put it is right there. Oh, that's not going to work for me. That is not going to work for me. Hang on. Because, see, the way that the lake is situated, I, I can only be on a, on a plains and water map on that corner so that's not going to work so we have it has to be over here but it can't be over here because it, it won't match up so let's go ahead and let's uh, close the map and t to edit the world all right so i need to i need two ink to be able to remove that so let's go ahead and make two ink I don't have any huckleberries because I cooked them all up. So let's go get some huckleberries. I need eight huckleberries. So that's three bushes. If I can find any more. No more on this map. Here we go. I can I can rotate them before I put them down, Michael. But to move to but to remove a piece, I have to I have to have ink, so I can alter my map. 
which is what we're doing now is I, I, I have to I gotta go make some ink so I can take out that one piece and move it around so I need two of these there we go I've got two ink now now we can go back to the map and this is I'm gonna remove this one T to edit world we're gonna remove that and then Close the map, go C. And now this this plane's prairie piece, instead of being like this, what I should have done was I should have rotated it like that and had it like that. Or I could have done it like this. That's probably smarter. Let's just do it. I, I don't want to have to run so far, but we're gonna. this is how we had to do it before. So that's what I'm going to do. And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to do the same thing again. And beeswax. I need one more beeswax. So let's head out. Have a little berry bowl. And a little water. All right. Hopefully, it's still early enough. I can get those provisions and get back before dark. Tweedly D, do I recommend this game? I mean, I'm playing it. It it seems fun. We really didn't get there's wild mint. Let's grab that. We really didn't get too far into it. There's a vanilla plant. There's some hemp. Because there's only so much we could do. In the prologue so i don't really know we'll play this for a couple of days we'll I'll live stream this for a couple of days in, in the mornings and we'll check it out like i said i don't normally do a top down a game but but considering it has to be it has to have a unique uh like take on something for me to do it and this you can make your own map pieces and move them around and stuff so i, I kind of like that Okay, we got a zombie on my on my tail here. Oh, you're shooting acid? Oh, you suck. Excuse me, I was coughing. Are you the only zombie? No, there's more than one. I don't have a freaking bow, yo. Come at, shoot at me. There we go. There we go. <sighs> Down he goes. They don't. They didn't hurt that bad. Search this guy. Common key. Canned beans, baby. A flint. Dead horse. This died. Okay, what tore his head off? The zombies. Open this up with a common key. Scrap parts. There we are. All right, I should return to them. All right, so, whoops. So we got that done. Uh, I'm coming back because there's a lot of unique stuff here in the prairie. But I want to get back to my house before it gets too dark, before we start dealing with nighttime animals and monsters. All right, so we found their provisions. Hmm. Thank heavens, this should be enough to keep us going for another couple of months at least. I hope we can get home, uh, uh, we, we can go home to Corpse Creek someday. We own that trading post out there. I can't imagine what state it's in right now. 
Well, yeah, you did. And now I can trade with you, right? I think I could have traded with you before anyway. Hmm. Thank you for retrieving those provi provisions. They're a real lifesaver after what happened to us in the prairie. Yeah, you're welcome. I'm trying to help uh, after everything that happened to the poor people in my old hometown. God, I miss her. Sorry, I'm, I'm drifting away. Are you need anything else? He's talking about his, his, his girlfriend. Or his wife. Well, our tents are pretty ripped up. Um, you know, would you do us another favor? We need to patch them holes in the tents. Sure. How do we fix the tents? Do you have any spare fabric? No, I don't have any spare fabric. But I can make fabric. All right, I have to create a tannery, gather cotton, and then craft fabric. All right. Just another part of the tutorial. I'm going home. It's spooky in the dark. Oh. We're going to start a fire. I guess I could close the door. And we're going to rest. Hungry and thirsty. Have some breakfast. Okay, I've got four water left. That's going to be enough for like three or four days. i got enough food for three or four days. Um, we have some cartography pieces we can get. Let's see. So I need one more flint. I need five more flint. And I have ten rocks. Well, I could make those right now. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's make the flint. Actually, let's go bust another couple of rocks. Now that I think about it. Because I can get flint from busting rocks. So, may as well do that. I still need that. If I can get one more beeswax, we can upgrade our workbench. That's what I want to do. Alright. Okay, we'll do, bust this one down too. There we go. There we go. Put the thing away. I, I don't like the way she like hunches over when she when she's. So the Plains Prairie piece here is a corner piece. See now now that with that with that piece I could have done what I want I needed to do. I think. Maybe not. Now let's do this. I need four four of these. So we need four four flint. So we'll go over and make flint. Wait, where is it? Equipment building. Handcrafted, there it is. Okay. This is the prairie. So that's a full full blown prairie piece. All right. So, because you can only we only had one provision piece. The prairie piece will get me my cotton. So I kind of want to pull this around, but let's. I want to finish these plains and lakes pieces. Let's um. Let's go map. So now I've got these. We can go ahead and we can go. Whoops. No, I want to go see. We can go add this. Let's go ahead and rotate. Put that right there. And then. Wait, can I not? I thought it was C. Hmm. 
No. Oh, I'm... Oh, 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 oh. Okay, here's what happened, guys. You have to explore the world to open up new map pieces that you can put down. Not the not new map pieces that you can you can now there there will also be new map pieces that you can that you can um, research but I have to explore before I can open up any more new map pieces that I can I can have so and then I can choose which ones I want to put down so I should have done the other one but that's okay see so, okay if I have a fishing rod I can fish right here which is cool. Oh, we're going to be good for now. I need to get uh, some more bees. I need bees. We're going to look for bees. I want to upgrade my workbench. we got a forest in here. Let's try this. There's also a zombie in here, too, that keeps respawning. It's probably going to keep respawning, too. I don't see any bees. Wait, there they are. There it is. Take some damage, but that's okay. Okay. That's two that's another beeswax and two more honey. Now we can go ahead and come back and do our thing. Upgrade my oh, I'm gonna need some bushes too, aren't I? I need fiber. Oh, no! I killed the huckleberry bush. It's the wrong bush. All right, Garwin. We'll see you later, man. All right. Plant fibers. Should be able to upgrade my workbench now. Yes. All right. So now I can do tin ore. Oh, I need tin ore to be able to upgrade it. But workbench two now I can do wooden table, wooden chair, tannery. Um, we can do an archway. We can do a big dresser for holding stuff. We got a fletching table so I can make a bow and arrow. Rocking chair, storage chest. I need two lumber for storage chest. Let's do that. I think if things are out for too long, they fall apart. So I may I may need to build my house a little bigger. I think we might want to do that. Um, and put our our benches inside. If nothing else, I think I need to build a porch for my for my my workbenches. So, I think I get my resources back if I demolish my workbenches, but I'm not sure. Let's see. Let's go ahead and let's hit it with a with a hammer. It won't let me. I thought I was able to... Oh, I need the hammer. Never mind. What am I doing? Remove the cartography table. Okay, I got my stuff back. Remove the workbench. All right, got, got that stuff back. I, I didn't get it all back, though. Damn it. I don't know if I'm going to be able to... Hang on. We got to go to bed. I might have screwed up. Maybe. Let's sheath my weapon. No. Get out of here. Oh, escape to cancel. My bad. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, rest for the night. <sighs> Save my game. And then let's slap down some... I'm going to need to slap down some foundations and, and make, a, make a porch, I think. Anyway, looking back, getting back into, I don't have, oh no. Yep, I don't have the, um, the honey. 
I mean the beeswax, but I wonder if maybe it'll just make the level, the, the tier two. Let's eat that meal. Eat that meal. Drink some water. That's good for now. I might just chop this stuff down. And we're just gonna, I'm just gonna clear this block here real quick. Oops, come on. Come on. There we go. And yes, I'm aware that if I if I if I if I collect things, I'll get more resources, but we're just gonna chop this down for now. Tree dynamo. Clear all the trees, man. Clear cut. I'm supposed to be living with nature. Let's chop this one down. Gather this up. Gather that up. We're just gonna do a wraparound porch on the on the uh, on the on the house, I think. I need to pick this up too. Move our campfire. And then Oh, I gotta I gotta I have to God damn it. This sucks because I have to put down a a, a a workbench so I can put down foundations so I can make foundations to put my workbench down, if that makes sense. Alright, we're gonna craft Ten foundations. There we go. So I'm going to slap one here, one there. We'll do a wraparound for right now. And then remove the workbench. Do I want the workbench there? I guess I'll put the workbench right here. Maybe I'll put it right here. No. I'll put it right there. And then I'm still going to need those stupid ramps. 
to get up here, am I? All right. Oh, I got it. That's four steps. So we'll put the we'll put a step. Come on, game. I guess I could rotate it and we can do that. It won't let me though. One right there. One right there. One right there. One right there. I think. I think that'll work. Maybe. Yeah, that works. All right. And then. I guess I'm going to log wall this. Cartography table. If it'll let me put that log wall. I don't know if it'll let me put a. Put a a wall up or not? Place this right here. If it'll, yeah, okay, we're good. right now place that right there and then oh this is a tier 2 workbench all right so it does okay 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 so it did automatically upgrade my workbench when i put it down once you unlock it you're good so that's that's fine i'm okay with that Let's go ahead and let's see if we can make ourselves another. Uh, I need one more lumber for my campfire, but we don't need to do that right now. We're going to go to bed. <sighs> okay. All right. So I'm going to need to. Chop some more trees down. Hello. I've got two more map pieces I can throw down here in a second. We're gonna do that. I'm gonna I wanna finish up that that um that lake. Okay, I've got three world pieces now. Alright, so we got three world pieces ready right now. Let's go ahead and do that. Um I want the let's see here. Well, I need two more to finish up the lake. So we'll put that one there. And then we want this one to be the lake. Now the lake is finished. And then I've got one more I can put down. So we're going to go ahead and I think it was the full-blown prairie that I wanted. Which I think... No. We'll have to be like right here. I guess we'll do that right now, for now. All right, so that's cool. So now we've got the now we get the resources I need. It's just a long walk though. 
We're gonna rotate. We're gonna. We're, we will modify this later on. But right now, I'm just. Let's see what's my map look like. Um. I guess we're gonna go in here and cut down these trees here because I need. I need those trees. Oh, I need food and water too. Hang on. So, two, three fills me up, and then that's good on my water. Okay, good. But I need trees, yo. I think I have enough. I think I have enough. Um, what do you call it? Feathers for right now. I'm going to need more feathers, but I'm not going to be searching trees right now. And all this stuff does grow back eventually, so we're I'm not too worried about it. Yeah, yeah, the game goes live in 30 minutes, so it'll be up for sale in about 30 minutes, guys. They gave me access early, so. They only gave me access, like, yesterday evening, so I I, I was like, I'll just wait, and we'll just mess around with this with, 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 with the coffee crew in the morning. Oh, those were bur oh no it told me that was a huckleberry bush too come on do one more uh, world piece so let's see uh, if I want to do a pine forest I could do a pine forest right there no I can't it has to be it has to lead in I could do a pine forest here and then we could do another yeah let's do that let's do that that'll give me some more wood to work with Grab those mushrooms. All right, we're going to go. Let's head back right quick. I want to see what I can do. I have to create a tannery. But I also wanted to put a roof over this stuff. I can't get up there. I gotta build steps around the back. These steps look kind of janky, though. I mean, I guess they work, but. So, real quick, let's go ahead and make some roofs. Unless there's some other roofs I can make. I don't think so. I guess that's it on the on this on this basic log roof. I'll make a few of those. That would work for now. And that's a recipe book. What? This book contains all the recipes discovered while cooking. Oh, I can make one. I can make a regular axe if I have beeswax. Oh wait. Oh yeah, no, I want I want this. We need beeswax. I can make a flint pickaxe and a flint axe. We definitely need that, 100%. Um Let's go ahead and do this.
I need another wall right there. Oh, I need a doorway, actually. I need a doorway. Two doorways. No, wait. A window. So... Got a doorway here. And the window. There. And then I've got shelter too. So this is what this is what it's all about, man. Now I get another perk. I need to step out of here so I can see what the hell I'm doing. Making a little... A little garage here. I guess we're going to bed. I'm not that <sighs> tired, but... All right, so I need a tannery, but I also need, I need to get I need to get, put my my fireplace down. We went out for that firewood because I, I needed to build a fire, and I forgot. I'm just gonna put this out. I guess I'll put it right there. That's fine. Oh, you know what? We can put it right here. That'll do. All right. I gotta eat and drink. And there we go. All right. So and I get a a perk. So let's go ahead and let's add a perk. Let's see. Shelter level two. I could have improved fire making. Um, fires burn for thirty percent longer. Or cooked meals provide twenty percent more replenishment. Or Wood used for bonfires is more dry and, and, and flames burn hotter. Restored fatigue by near bonfires increased by 50%. I think I went with the food perk. Yeah, I want the food perk right now. I can switch this out at any time too, so. All right, so that's good. Let's make a tannery. If I can, if I have what I need, I do. Okay, so we've got a tannery now. Slap that down right here. Rotate that. How close can I get to it? Like that, like that close? There we go. All right, now I got to gather cotton, but I want to go ahead and see what else I can make here. I already got the bed, got the photography table. We've got, uh, we did all that. Tier two. I'm um, going to make some furniture for my house because it's going to help with my shelter. And I should get, if I can get tier three, that'd be great. What's this? A fletching table. I need two flint. Let me go ahead and make flint. There we go. Now let's make a fletching table under tier two, if I can get to it. All right, that's good. Now I got the long bow, the short bow and the arrows. And I don't care about the decorative dressers, but I will make a storage chest. All right, so now I've got all this noise. This is great. So let's see if we can put the fletching table down right there. Let's see if we can put down, let's see, storage chest. Uh, I guess that'll, that'll do right there. Or you know what?
Maybe we'll put it inside the house instead. Put the storage chest right here. And I've got a wooden chair I'll put right there. And did I make a table? I thought I made a table. Did I not make a table? Because I thought... Well, I can make rope too. There's the fabric. Hmm. Well, I guess I didn't make a table. Let's make a table. Now I know I made a table. Let's go and slap this down right here. There it is. Oh, it won't fit. Sure it will. I was hoping for better. I don't know. Did that? Did that go up? That's that's scouting. Shelter. No, it didn't go up. I thought it was going to go up with with, um, with having furniture in there. That's fine. Let's go ahead and let's make uh, a couple more ramps so I can get up and down these stairs in the back. At least one more. We'll make one more. Rotate up. We'll have to make more than one, I think. Oh, no. It let me up. That's good. That's fine. All right. Well, we spent most of the day here getting uh, getting things set up at least a little bit. I think we're good. I think I'm going to play this for the next couple of days, guys, in the morning. Uh, we will have uh, Occupy Mars in, uh, later on in, during the day. Um, so... Don't worry, it is coming. Um, but I want to play this. I want to see how far we into the into the um, the game we can get as far as you know getting uh, getting through the storyline and and see what we can craft. But right now, I think I'm going to end it, guys. It's been two hours. Thanks for coming in. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, give us a thumbs up. And if I've earned your subscription, don't forget to hit that bell icon for notifications. Good to see everybody after a couple of days of not live streaming. <laughs> all right, guys. Well, as I always say, I am my usual me. Be your usual you, and we'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching, guys. We'll see you later.